If you can speak in unknown tongue, if you can speak in tongues, open up your mouth and pray this morning. Just give God a worship, give God a praise. We bless the name of the Lord this morning. We thank the Lord, 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 we we bless the name Rake <laughs> Rotu the boss, 
We bless the name of the Lord this morning. We give God praise and honor and glory. We thank God for his greatness. Hallelujah. We are doing some scriptural prayer points this morning, and most of our prayer points will come from Psalms 1. 21 and it says I will lift up my eyes unto the hills hallelujah from whence cometh my help my help cometh from the Lord the Lord which made heaven and earth this morning we are praying and we are saying oh God I thank you for my help I thank you that you are my help this morning I will look on to you because you are my help open up your mouth and pray this morning that is your word I thank you Lord that you are my help Thank you, Lord, that you are my helper. I lift up my eyes on you, because you are my helper. You are my helper, Lord. You are my helper, Lord. The name of the 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 Lord. Thank you, Lord. I lift my eyes on you, Lord Jesus. Lord, Lord, for you are my my help, O Lord, my very present help, God, God, we look to you this morning, amen, one next prayer point we are praying, we are declaring, O Lord, the, the next verse says, he who, he will not suffer thy foot to be moved, he that keepeth thee will not slumber nor sleep. Right where you see thee, you can put your name there. He will not suffer my foot to be moved. He that keepeth me, crystal, will he will not slumber nor sleep. Open up your mouth and pray this morning, O oh Lord. I thank you for keeping me, Lord. I thank you, Lord, that you will not slumber, you will not sleep on me, God. I thank you for coming me this morning uh, in the name of Jesus. Thank you for keeping my family and thank you for keeping me this morning in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for keeping my family. Thank you for keeping me in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, Lord. I thank you for keeping me this morning. In the name of Jesus, Rikatayana Masu, Rikatayana Masu, thank you, Lord, for keeping me. Thank you, Lord, for keeping me. Thank you, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord, that you don't slumber, you don't sleep. Thank you for keeping us this morning. Thank you for keeping us, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord, for keeping us. Somebody else. Thank you, Lord, for keeping us to keep us slumber. You never thank you, oh Lord. Thank you for keeping us in the future. Thank you for keeping us this morning. Thank you, Lord, for keeping us. Letting your angels try to Thank you for keeping us this morning. Thank you for keeping us. 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 
God is so faithful. He is so faithful to us that he never slumber, he never sleep. Listen, please. I don't know about you, but I need to sleep. You know, you sometimes you need to rest. But this God that we serve, he keep it the he will not slumber. Hey, my God, this God is a faithful God, and I thank God for him. Amen. This verse says, He that keepeth Israel, yes, never slumber, not sleep right. We are thanking God this morning. Open up your mouth and thank God for his faithfulness because he never sleeps, he never slumber, he's always keeping you, he's always watching you. No matter when you wake up, you sleep, you change your clothes, you do whatever, he's keeping you. That is a faithful God. Open up your mouth and pray this morning. For your faithfulness, for your faithfulness, never slumber over my life. Thank you, Lord, Thank you, Lord, for your faithfulness. Thank you, Lord, for your faithfulness. Thank you, Lord, for your faithfulness. Thank you, Thank you, for your faithfulness. You never sleep, you never slumber. Thank you, thank you, Lord. Somebody say thank you, Lord. You never sleep, you never slumber. Thank you for your faithfulness. Thank you for your faithfulness this morning. Thank you for your faithfulness this morning. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, thank you, Lord, for your faithfulness. Thank you for your faithfulness this morning. You never sleep, you never slumber this morning. We thank you, God, for your faithfulness. We thank you, Lord, for your for your faithfulness, Lord, you keep us alive. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for your faithfulness this morning. Thank you, Lord, for your faithfulness this morning. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for your faithfulness. You never see Thank you for your faithfulness. Somebody declare it this morning. Thank you, Lord, for your faithfulness. You are faithful, God. 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 You are faithful, In the name of Jesus, you are faithful. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. For you are faithful. In Jesus' name, amen and amen and amen. Hallelujah. The Bible says in verse 5, the Lord is thy keeper. Oh God. Well, someone on the line, your, your line is really cracking. It's making that cracking noise. I don't know who you are. Please try and adjust that. Amen. The Bible says, the Lord is like keeper 
The Lord is thy shade upon thy right hand. This morning, the Bible says, The sun shall not smite thee by day, nor the moon by night. I want to let you know this morning that the sun and the moon can work against you. They can go to the sun and employ the sun to work against you. They can pray to the moon and employ the moon to work against you. They can go Go to different elements of the earth and employ it to work against you. I have seen it here in the Bible. It is there in the Bible. Even us as people of God can say, oh God, let the sun, the moon, and the stars work on my behalf. I pray for you today. The Bible says, the sun shall not smite thee by day, nor the moon by night. Open up your mouth. I pray this morning. Our prayer point is, O oh Lord, the sun, the moon shall work on my behalf in the name of Jesus. Because wait, if we see here that in this verse that it says, the sun shall not smite thee by day, which means the sun, the sun could smite you by day and the moon by the night. So let us pray this morning and we are praying, O oh Lord, let the sun and the moon work on my behalf in the name of Jesus. Open up your mouth and pray this morning, O oh Lord. Let the sun and the moon work on my behalf in the name of Jesus. Let the sun work on my behalf. in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, mighty God, let the moon in the name of Jesus, the sun shall not shine in the night, nor the moon by night, child by in the name of they shall not employ the sun they shall not employ the moon the in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus I want to let you know that this this is such a real thing. I was back in Trinidad in my early ministry, doing ministry, and I went with my then um, uh, uh, um, man of God then, and we went to do a prayer assignment. Amen. And um, we would see that as the sun rises, there was this young boy we went to pray for. As the sun rises and the sun shines brighter, the guy comes outside and speaks to the sun. Now, what 
what they did against that young man. They went to India and they erected an altar against him. And they started to speak to the, the son to work against him. As the sun rises, his mother would say he would come outside and start to speak to the son. The mother said he would come outside and sit down under the sun. Now, for those of you who live in the Caribbean or know what hot sun is, please, when you go outside for a few minutes, you are running away from the sun. This young man was so so tormented by that altar that he would sit there until the hot midday sun and he would not move and he would start to point at the sun and talk to the sun and the sun is blazing and his mother would pray and cry and you know it it, it is so it is so deadly when people are so evil and it, the thing is it was his family members that did that evil but the thing is what I want to let you know they employ the son to work against him that it, when it's raining he's not going outside to talk hallelujah but when the son out uh, he's outside there under the sun talking to the sun uh, can you imagine mm -hmm. my god they strike that boy with madness Harabataya. i pray for each and every one of you today uh, that the elements mm -hmm. of this uh, will not be employed uh, to work against you neither your family uh, in jesus mm -hmm. name mm -hmm. hallelujah the Bible yeah. says in verse 7, the Lord shall preserve thee from all evil. He Thank shall preserve God. thy soul. Amen. This morning we are praying and we are saying, oh God, preserve me, preserve my family, preserve my soul. Open up your mouth and pray this morning. Oh, God. oh my God. Oh, my God. My Preserve me, Lord. Raise me, Abasaya. Preserve me from wicked men. Preserve me from evil men. Preserve me, O God. Preserve me, O Lord, in the name of Jesus. Preserve me, O God, from the workers of iniquity. Preserve me, O God, from men that slay me. Preserve my family, God. Preserve me, preserve me, Lord, in the name of Jesus, mighty God. Oh God, preserve me. Preserve me. Preserve me, O God, in the name of Jesus. Ask the Lord to preserve you. Preserve you. Hide you under the shadow of the Almighty from evil men. O Lord, preserve me. Preserve me, Lord. In the name of Jesus, Lord, preserve me, O God. Preserve me from spiritual weakness. Preserve me. Preserve me from the Preserve me this Preserve me that. Preserve me from wickedness. That they wait for my soul. Preserve me this morning. Because Oh Lord, preserve me this morning. Oh Lord, preserve me by the power of the Holy Ghost. Preserve me, Lord. Preserve me, Lord. Preserve me, Lord. Preserve me, Lord. Preserve me, Lord, this morning. Evil assignments of the enemy. Preserve me this morning. 
this morning i want to pray for each and every one of you there is a video that i placed on my facebook page and this video is a man transforming into well he was a pig transforming into a man and i want to let you know many people i see the comments they are saying uh, is this for real is this uh, what neighborhood it is what not uh, i want to let you know that this is real and true these things are real and normal for those of you that are in the caribbean uh, they transform to pigs they transform to larger bless sukunya they transform to, to horse they transform to different things I, I don't know if you are in the caribbean you can identify with me yes hallelujah those of you that have heard and seen it already anyway if it is you have not i've seen i've seen, I've seen the video that you posted prophetess amen amen the video is there but in real life this happens in this in the caribbean this happens i can't speak for any other part of the world but i know for the caribbean it happens all right amen yes uh, there are people that change and transform themselves into pigs into horses uh, they change and transform themselves into half man half beast uh, yes and i i'm telling you that this is real so people of god uh, i want to let you know that when you come into interaction with with uh, people uh, you may think that they are human uh, sometimes they are mm. not I'm telling you even about something that I saw here in Canada. I was walking down the street one day, uh, one of the busy streets uh, downtown. Uh, and I and I keep walking, I'm walking, uh, and I see this big tail. Every time I talk about this, it gives me a uh, little chills because it's so real. I see it with my eye. I was walking down the street and this guy, there's a big tail that swung out from behind him. I said, my God, what is that? And I saw the tail like the dog tail wagging. It's not a dog tail. It is a tail, a black tail that is wagging behind the man. And after that, I rubbed my eye. I closed my eye. I didn't see it again. So anyway, I am walking in the direction of the man. He is walking past me. He's going to walk past me. So as he walks up past me, I looked. I looked behind him. I said, God, I know what I saw. And I saw that man with a tail Rekatai. I want to let you know something uh, that sometimes you come into interactions with people uh, and they are not people uh, they are filled with demons they are filled with evil powers uh, Hakatai. I want to let you know today uh, that you have to be very careful of who you come in contact with uh, in this world on this earth uh, people are not people uh, they are not what you think they are Rekatai. Sometimes you send your children out to school. You don't know who is teaching your children. You don't know if they're in the different secret societies. You don't know what is happening. You come and you smile. Of course, when you drop your children off, you smile with them. So they smile. But inside of them, they are demons. I saw another live video clip like this. There was this man is walking with his knapsack and another guy is walking and all of a sudden the, the guy without the knapsack start to pursue the guy with the knapsack to steal his bag and I'm telling you uh, that the the, the the rubber pushed down the guy with the bag and try, and tried to take the bag the guy who had the knapsack on his back, a spirit raised up out of him and started to fight the thief a spirit raised up out of him and started to fight the thief, Rekatai, while the man was on the ground. 
I want to let you know uh, that as I saw, I don't know, I don't know how come I didn't save that, but these things I want to save so that you guys can see. It is Amen. real, 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 real. Mm -hmm. I know about it. Uh, there's some stories that I heard about the African side where sometimes they'll have spirits dancing and there is nobody, nobody in it, but the, you know, it is clothed with something and it, the, you know, there is evil in this world, people of God. And I pray for you today uh, that no evil uh, shall come near you, uh, that no power, and, and this is not myth, this is not tales, uh, this is even things that my father have told me that he has seen with his own eyes, that I myself, in, in back in the Caribbean, you would see the ball of fire raising up and flying. You know, and many times um, we as young people, you would laugh and you'd say, oh, my gosh, look at that star. It is not a star. It's a ball of fire. They call it the sukunya. They take off their skin. They take off their skin. They put it in a barrel and they turn and they start to fly, you know, and they visit whoever homes and whatnot. I want to let you know, people of God, this earth that we live in, it's real. It's real demonic because where was the devil? Devil cast down. He was cast down to the earth, right where we are. Rekataya. And sometimes we want to be so naive about certain things. But this is why we have to be covered with the blood of Jesus. This is why we have to arise and pray and keep ourselves covered from these wicked assignments. Uh, you know, I'm not telling you this to neg you out or to make you feel like, okay, God is not powerful. He is, but there are some prerequisites requisites that we need to do as a child of God uh, to be uh, we, we need to be covered uh, from these amen. evil assignments amen hallelujah yeah. so our final prayer point we are praying uh, verse 8 says Lord uh, the Lord shall preserve thy going out and thy coming in uh, from this time uh, and even forevermore let us pray that prayer point this morning oh Lord uh, preserve oh Lord for God from this time Let your life be on a spiritual one. I think you 
I want to make some announcements. I want to make some announcements that uh, I want to do the prayer for the children. I keep saying that, but I keep, it slips me because there's so many things going on. So I want to be able to do that. Amen. Uh, I will set a date for that this week so that we can get that done, as well as uh, tune in uh, this afternoon on Facebook, 6 p.m. for our live broadcast, as well as we have another powerful woman of God coming on Wednesday on Zoom. Amen. So uh, keep your mind and heart together. God is uh, using many of us right among us here to send his word. Amen. And then um, every morning, 3 a.m. prayer, I want you to uh, do something. Uh, invite someone. Uh, amen. Uh, these are amen. simple prayer points, but the prayer points are going to help deliver and set people free uh, from what uh, they are going through. Amen. Uh, so those of you that are here, share the link, share the broadcast. Amen. Share it. It's on, it's on Facebook so that people can also share it from there. Amen. Uh, may God be praised over your life and family. In Jesus' name. God bless you. Make this peace. Amen. 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 Amen.